Hi, I'm Kim at uh, Apex 2016. I'm joined today by uh, Jack and Chris from Ventec. Now, um, loads happening in the States um, for Ventec. Lots for sure, of investment yeah. um, in both machines and people. So, Jack, I'm going to start with you. Can you tell us, give us a review of what's been going on and the reasons uh, behind that? What's driving it? Sure, I appreciate it. You know, I mean, our, our our products have really positioned us for growth in between our polyimid and um, for the mill aero market segment and our IMS materials for the um, LED lighting market have really exploded. And so in order to support that growth, um, we have uh, invested in our facilities primarily in the West Coast with uh, clean rooms and um, you know, separating rooms for epoxy prepreg and polyimid prepreg and really investing into um, the type of uh, infrastructure that will support um, the quality that we're looking for. We're the only company in laminator in the world that has AS9100C. So in order to support, you know, of course, equipment and infrastructure is one thing, but we really wanted to invest in people as well. Um, so I'm really happy, you know, uh, uh, to let everyone know that we hired Chris Alessio uh, about a month ago to join as Vice President of Sales and Operations, and you know, Chris is going to really help me drive our sales growth. Uh, to be honest, it's been um, quite a load to bear over the last 12 months with the growth that we've seen. Um, and in addition to Chris, we've hired uh, technical people and a new uh, uh, someone to join our OEN group. Uh, primarily to support the mill aero segment. So, um, you know, in order to support that growth with infrastructure and also people is really where we're at. So, um, and you know, we've got a um, really terrific person in Chris that has a um, just a, a terrific history of growth and uh, his previous positions and uh, is going to bring that to Ventec. Chris, congratulations. Thank you. Um, obviously, huge challenge ahead and, and um, lots of success that uh, you've, you've clocked in your previous career. Give us a little bit of an overview of what you did in your previous career and what you're going to be doing for Ventec. Absolutely, yeah. By the way, I'm delighted to be part of the Ventec team. Uh, it's fun to get back into, uh, back into the electronics world here. I was fortunate to have a little bit of time off. Uh, but my career started uh, a long time ago with Apple Computer, and I was a supplier quality engineer for printed circuit boards. So uh, this goes back to uh, the early 90s. Spent a fair amount of time at Apple and then moved into a sales role for integrated circuits, for a variety of semiconductors, for printed circuit boards, and contract manufacturing. That then led me into the EMS world really full time. Uh, I've been doing that for 20 plus years. Um, and on the periphery, PCBs, as we would source a lot of printed circuit boards. Uh, but laminates, frankly, for me, are a bit of a, a new area, which is why it's exciting. You know, I've done all the EMS stuff I think I ever want to do. Uh, printed circuit boards, okay. Uh, now we're going a little further up the food chain here into the laminate space. And I can say, Ventec is exciting from a lot of aspects. One is it's a small company, and I really enjoy small companies and helping them gain footing and grow, uh, particularly in the U.S. We're a large company worldwide. You know, we're approaching $200 million in sales, so we're a big player in the laminate market. But in the U.S., it's, it's a fairly new territory for us, and we see a lot of opportunity, particularly with our polyimid, as Jack mentioned a few minutes ago, and our IMS materials, the metal-backed uh, substrates. So, uh, and that's just a couple areas. There's also new stuff on the horizon that we're not going to talk about today. Uh, next year at the show, we'll be int introducing some really exciting products, and, and, that, and that's what gets the juices flowing. You know, we have the standard, you know, equivalent to some of our competitors out there with uh, our VT47 product. We have the 901, the 90H, which is polyimids. But again, very soon, we will be uh, looking to leapfrog some competitors and certain materials. Um, so happy to be here. Really looking forward to help grow the team here in the U.S. We are adding capability in Northern California. So we have a Southern California hub right now in Fullerton where we have a press, um, where we have a full stocking, cutting, punching, repackaging, and of course, local delivery to our customers. Uh, we're adding that capability in Fremont. And then we have it elsewhere in the country with Illinois, Boston, Massachusetts area, um, and Toronto. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you, you're very much supporting each other. Is, how are you then setting up, is it by 
by region, by customer segment, industry segment? How, how is that going to work? I think uh, um, initially it'll certainly be by region. Uh, Chris is West Coast based, I'm East Coast based, so it, you know, it's uh, logically uh, very easy for us to split the country up and, um, and that really helps us out quite a bit. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Well, that sounds great. I look forward to um, seeing you next year with the, with the new um, developments in store. Great seeing you, Jack, again, thank and you uh, thank you for your time today. Thank you.